Doesn't get much closer than this. A pickup truck blows a path right through the middle of a home and it barely misses the homeowner who was asleep on the couch. Amazingly, neither the driver nor that homeowner was injured, but the house was badly damaged. Good evening to you. I'm David Wade. I'm Lisa Hughes. The woman says there was no warning. And as Julie McDonald shows us, her first instinct was to check on the driver. The homeowner says that a miracle happened here. When that truck veered off the road and into the house, she and neighbors thought there'd been an explosion. I'm counting my lucky stars that I'm not dead. Uh, I'm pretty sure I've got quite a few guardian angels up there watching over me. It was a late morning nap that Tracy Samuels will never forget. The Templeton wife and mom was jolted awake Thursday by a pickup within arm's reach. And I heard a loud bang, huge bang, I should say. And I woke up yelling, what in the world is going on? And I turn around and I see a truck sitting in my living room and I said, why is there a truck in my living room? It had plowed through everything, taking all her furniture, even the Christmas tree and the family's gifts. Samuel said outside, a man was freaking out. The guy that was driving the truck is outside running around like a chicken with his head cut off saying, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. The house shifted off its foundation and the Samuels are expecting the worst. But Tracy and her son and that driver are all okay. That's what she's focusing on. It happened. Move on. Because if you sit there and you dwell on it, it's just going to bring you down even further. You got to take, take what life hands you and just keep going. The family's insurance company has set them up at a nearby hotel. Now they'll wait to see what's next for their home, temporarily condemned by the building inspector. In Templeton, Julie McDonald, WBZ News.